When I first saw this next story, I could hardly believe it. See if you feel the same way when you learn what farmer Ralph McGregor's feeding his dairy cattle, Ron Martin reports. Several years ago, dairyman Ralph McGregor took the advice of a livestock nutritionist and began feeding his cows chocolate. Each of his cows gets four pounds of chocolate a day, or the equivalent of about 32 candy bars. It seems like a lot of candy, but when it's mixed in the, into that total mixed ration, there is so much other material uh, that, it, uh, that it really isn't uh, a, a chocolate or a confection uh, uh, pure as we think of it. Cows need energy to produce milk, and chocolate's high sugar and fat content has about twice the energy of corn. It's also cheaper than corn. Corn costs anywhere from $85 to $100 a ton, and McGregor can get damaged candy from the Hershey Chocolate Company for about $60 a ton. McGregor's nutritionist says chocolate also shows signs of boosting milk's butterfat content, which in turn would bring higher prices. But despite its advantages, only a handful of dairy farmers in the mid-Atlantic states are using candy because of its limited availability. I have a lot of farmers that would like to do it right now. The, the only thing I believe holding us back is just, you know, the supply of the product, really. The McGregor cows have been on chocolate for about six years now, and the nutritionist says there has yet to be a cavity, at least among the cows. When the uh, product doesn't get completely ground, uh, the dairymen have trouble keeping their kids out of his feed supply. Ron Martin for NBC News in Dover, Pennsylvania. And the question we're all asking ourselves is, do the cows deliver chocolate milk? But we don't know the answer to that.